Because you never know, you know, if something is like sneaking around or what. Hello! Like this, for example? Kill this stupid thing. Move. This is worth you get out of there. You. Alright, attack! Throw an. Throw a missile at him. That's not right! You point! I there. Punch. Okay. Onward! Live by the sword! Live a good long time! Onward! Hello! More werewolves! Swords, not words. Ready. How the heck did werewolves get in here? And Give why did you. Direction. Oh. Yeah. Duh. I'll see. Okay. And it's an arrow. <laughs> this thing is so narrow that. Yeah, this, this whole Please area is so narrow. That we can't act. We can only have one guy there. We can't actually sneak around. Every if you notice, Minx is kind of pinned because no one else can even get past him. Stand back, back up! <laughs> back up! Get out of there, Minx! Armored, You're a freaking idiot! Get out of there! Back up! Like I told you to do! Now we have to waste one of these potions because you're an idiot. Get back. See battle bo run bo run. Let's try to pull all these guys back so we can actually have more than one character of fighting them. There. All right. I await your what do you need? Now all of you attack. Yeah. The problem the scenery in this game does tend to block and make fighting in these tight quarters rather difficult in a lot of cases. Bull says, make way, villainy. There, now finally you answer. You require my counsel, yes? Yeah. You point, I point. With vengeance. Minx wasn't even responding before. You know, that's just irritating. Switch to your sling Mince so you can help too. Stand there. And of course they give no XP. Okay, well. There. Quick save it. I am ready. All right, Jahira, heal yourself. And then heal Yashimo. Every hamster, but kicking for goodness. All right, now let's go back. Continue around this thing. Although they're not giving any XP, we may as well just walk into the room, but. And it keeps saying illusion dispelled too, so something tells me that th these aren't exactly real. Yeah, let's. Okay, we actually can't continue around this way. Because there's no path. So, what about the other way? Alright, come on, guys. Just walk over here then. Just walk over here. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Alright, now you just start heading up this way. Hello! There's another one. No effect. That's not right! Fortunately, this time we can actually get around them. So everybody can attack. Although Jahira's weapon has no effect, that could make this rather difficult. 
because Minx is the only Minx and Yashimo are the only ones that can actually hurt this creature. There. There. Okay, let's see if there's anything else, but I don't think so. Yeah. No. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, come on down. Then we'll go into this building. This is actually a fairly neat little quest. Not exactly what you would expect to see once it's all said and done, but so you don't really expect to see some guy taking control of a circus tent. Who are you? Oh, whoever you are, you must flee this place at once. He's he's killed everyone else who has come into this place. Almost. Oh, please run. What the heck? You're an o you're an ogre. That does not sound like an ogre's voice. I I'm not a monster. I'm a an elf, a winged elf, or at least I was. This discovering you see is some kind of illusion, but if you believe in it, then it becomes real. Please, please believe me. Now go before something happens to you. I beg of you. What the? Who? Okay. Never heard of a winged elf. What are you talking about? I I come from a race of winged elves. Although there aren't many of us left, from the Sundabar Mountains in the far north. My wings were cut off a long time ago, though. But but that isn't important. This place is too dangerous. Go back to the city and warn everyone what is happening here. You must flee. Okay, well, what exactly is happening here first? Oh, I hope you don't end up like like the others, but all right. My, my name is Aerie. I work in the circus with my uncle Quail. I don't know exactly what happened, but everything changed a few days ago. Everything became chaos and turned into what you see here. Although it all isn't real, it's an illusion. The minions, they all say they serve Kalas, so I know he's behind all of this. He's an illusionist in the circus, but I don't understand how he was able to do all of this. He must be stopped before he hurts any more people. Please, if you re if you release me from my chains, I can help you stop him. Chains? I don't see any chains on you. How do I release you then? Why can I not just dispel the illusions of this place? I don't see any chains on you. The chains are invisible, covered by the illusion, and, and they are magical. They prevent me from casting my own spells, and they maintain the illusion which is placed on me. Okay... Then why can't I just dispel them? I don't know. I tried earlier when this first happened. Kala's spells are too powerful somehow. He's he's never been that good though. So I don't know what he's done. If you free me though, together we can find out and stop him. And, and hopefully rescue my uncle Quail. How do I release you then? You you need the key to these chains, but it won't look like a key. There are a couple of commoners in the north side of this chamber. Don't be fooled by the illusion, though. They are monsters. They have a sword, which is actually my key. If you get it from them, I can remove the chain and regain my normal form. But please be careful. You can't trust anything you see here. Hmm. So in other words, this whole thing is rather Where Minsk goes, evil confusing. Aside. Basically nothing you see here is what it really is. So then the question is, what is everything? And who is this caller that's somehow been able to do this? All we know is that he's an illusionist. Means he's probably, well, means it might, he might be a gnome. But Oh, I am a simple woman. You, a talking spider? Oh, that's just rich. You don't seem like any creature I've encountered before. I'm not a creature, or at least I never used to be. Not until the circus and everything changed. Well then, who are you? My, my name's Hannah. I came to the circus with my son, although he didn't come into this 
tent with me. Oh, please help me. Then how did you become this creature? Alright, that didn't exactly answer my question. What's going on? Oh, I don't know. All I know is that I came into the tent to watch the performance. A gnome came on the stage and began to perform some kind of magical act. It was quite silly. It was obvious that whatever the gnome was trying to do wasn't working. His magic fizzled and everyone started laughing. I thought it was part of the act, so I laughed too. And then everything began changing. People be started transforming into creatures and then back into themselves. The world shifted somehow and I felt so sick and horrified. I think I passed out. When I woke up, I had been turned into this into this monstrosity. I I don't know what to do. My son didn't come into the tent with me and I'm frightened to think what may have happened to him. Okay. Um Well, I think your son is still outside. Wait here. He is. Oh, I will. Oh, thank you.